Hello again, everybody. Another tutorial. This is for Toyota 2015 that we have been uh, discussing so far. Uh, we have made a video about body control module. And I just want to point out a few things. So this is part two, actually. Uh, as we said, a body control module is responsible for accessories. Like you see over here, headlights, um, remote key, a keyless entry circuit, exterior lights, warning systems, uh, computer computer data lines. Every module has computer data lines. Uh, again, interior, uh, engine control, anti-theft, instrument cluster system. So whatever you're looking for, you look over here. And these are the pins over here. Two row, one row over here, as you can see. A1, A2, A3, all the way till here. Then there's another row, A1, till here. Top, there's another row, A1, A12, B1, B12. So, other thing is, uh, these modules need 12 volts. So, always, as I put in the green, battery, positive voltage, you always need 12 volts. And look at the ampage, 10 amps, not too much. Another one, 10 amps, not too much. So ignition voltage is 12 volts also. There's another one over here, park lamps also. So you have to be conscious of getting the right, the right fuse. If you're looking for the fuse or if you're looking for the right, the right 12 volts where it's coming from, you have to be conscious of these things, that these modules work on more than one 12 volt source from the battery. Over here, you can see, over here, 5 volt reference to what? LED, which means it gives off light, a diode that gives off light. So therefore, this is an ambient light sensor on top left side of dash. Usually the 5 volt reference comes in here, and this is the signal back to it. So this is like the output <coughs> to give it 5 volts, and this is the input on the white line on a6 and usually these leds drop about about maybe 1.2 volts 1.5 volts so you would expect about maybe 3.2 volts something like that and the reason is these are in the dash is because uh probably a daytime running lights whenever there's lights outside um it tells it tells it this chip knows this module knows when to turn on the daytime running lights if it's dark outside or if it's cloudy the um the amount of light hitting it will differ therefore it will give it a signal how much light there is and when to turn on the daytime running lights so be conscious of that and like we said the other ones interior light system headlight system and the difference, like I said a couple of times, the PCM has to do with engine performance, air, temperature, anything that goes into the into the engine, oxygen sensors, anything, exhaust, anything. <clears throat> that's the difference between them. So try to keep this in mind and hope to see you in the next video.